When I see a broken sticker, I have broken trust. Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Erica Tesla here. If you are returning, thank you so much for checking back in with me. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. Thanks for deciding to click on this video. If you're not familiar with my channel, I love everything makeup related and I spend a lot of time talking about makeup products, looks, swatches, all of that fun stuff. It's a pretty chill corner over here. So if you're interested in that, definitely hit that subscribe button. Make sure to like this video if you enjoy makeup content and leave me a comment. I always love it when you guys say hi. So let's go ahead and hop into this video. It's going to be really fun. We're going to do some lip swatching with the brand new Super State Vinyl Ink Liquid Lipsticks by Maybelline. So this is a really fun video in terms of just exploring a new product at the drugstore or new-ish to me. I first saw these lipsticks at my local Walgreens. I was just perusing the makeup aisles as one does and I saw these on the display and was really excited to just be able to potentially pick them up but then I saw that the little sticker was broken and when I see a broken sticker I have broken trust. I do not trust products where the seal is broken because that usually means somebody decided to like swatch it, potentially put it on their lips. I would hope not. But in any case, I happened to have a gift card to Ulta and ordered them from Ulta. They arrived and I'm actually right now wearing the shade Sultry number 160, but we're going to go ahead and swatch these and then try on each shade and you guys can tell me at the end of this video, which shade or shades appealed the most to you. So let's go ahead and get into it. We're gonna do swatches in number order. And so I'm gonna start with number 145, Rogue, which is this really pretty peachy color. And I'm just gonna swatch these on my hands. So I'm, I'm looking at my monitor here to see like where I can swatch this. So sorry if these aren't the best. So that's Rogue. Very pretty pink color, a little peachy. And what I like about these, these came out, I think they're part of like a like a Valentine's promotion. But these are perfect for springtime. So that was 145. Then we have 150, which I think was the one that really caught my eye. It's this bright color called striking. This is absolutely beautiful. This kind of reminds me of I want to say, let me, let me focus this for you guys. Was it candy yum yum? There was this Mac shade that used to be like this really pretty hot pink color. So that is striking. And then, okay, let's see. We did 145, 150, 155 is upbeat, which is this like really cute baby pink color and it comes out a little bit different than the packaging. That's one thing I'll say about these. I don't think, well, I guess it kind of matches the packaging. In person, it looks a little different. That's really cute. And these do dry down. Next, we have 160, which is what I have on my lips right now. This one, again, a sultry. Let me show you guys that one real quick. So they're sultry. I would say this one is like a very everyday wearable shade. And you can see on me, like it's really complimentary. I do have a medium-ish skin tone, so it might look a little bit lighter if you have deeper skin and deeper if you have lighter skin. And then the last one is 165 Edgy. I was really excited about this shade. I thought this shade would like match the packaging a little bit more. And this is like more straight up purple. Do you see that? And then the packaging is not quite the same. I, I guess it's supposed to give you a hint. I don't know. But I was hoping that this shade would actually match the packaging that it came in. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and wipe what I have on my lips off. And we're going to go shade by shade. And yeah, let me know what you guys think. So here we have 145. Thank you. 
All right, 150 striking. All right, we've got 155 upbeat. Okay, we have 160 Sultry, which is the shade that I started out with. Last but not least, we have Edgy. So those were the lip swatches, just to give you an idea of how they look on the lips versus just like hand swatches. And I went ahead and I went back over the initial swatches just so you can see these really built up to full opacity. This is definitely one of my like all time favorite drug drugstore lip products and like the formulation is really good. These are really long wearing. I have many of the other shades. So of course I was really excited to see that they came out with new colors for the spring. I will say the only thing is that a couple of the shades, I think they looked a little bit different in the packaging than they did actually on. Particularly these two shades, I would say upbeat and edgy. So this like really like light pink packaging and this more light purple packaging the shades came out like a little bit different particularly for edgy i would actually say edgy's not very edgy it's actually pretty tame and that's not necessarily a bad thing it's a really pretty purple color and if you like purpley mauvey tones but felt a little bit intimidated by the packaging and the outer component I would say just go for it because it's actually pretty tame and would go with a lot of different looks that you might want to try to do. And so, yeah, overall, I highly recommend these. This is one of my favorite drugstore lip product formulas, long wearing, affordable. And I would even argue that if you are looking at some of the like higher end brands, like the shades that they're coming out with would compete with some of those like new colors that we're seeing coming out for spring for a much more affordable price speaking of which the price is variable i've seen these ranging in price anywhere from like eight to twelve dollars depending on which retailer you purchase them from again i got mine from ulta i used points and coupons to get the price down on these so i think i ended up paying under ten dollars per lip product plus i had a gift card so really i was essentially gifted these by a generous friend who gave me a gift card for my birthday but um, I think I would have probably purchased a couple of these on my own anyway had that not been the case just because again I am a really big fan of Maybelline lip products. I think for years I will say they've been one of my favorite drugstore brands and I really like their lip lipstick formula like their regular bullet lipsticks and when these came out I was really happy and I think these are really great products um, if you are in any industry where you're like out all day these are really fantastic I definitely would recommend checking these out if you happen to see them if you're lucky enough to see them in the wild untouched like definitely pick them up otherwise I would recommend ordering these online until people learn how to behave around makeup in the drugstore anyway that being said thank you so much for hanging out I just wanted to pop this quick video up for you guys and let you see how these lip products look on someone with my complexion let me know if this was helpful for you if you like lip swatch videos make sure to like this leave me a comment letting me know which color or colors were your favorite and please consider subscribing it really means a lot to have you join my little corner of the internet and be a part of my makeup community i really do appreciate it thank you as always for spending a little bit of time with me i will see you guys in the next video bye